hello everyone in this video we are going to see what is respiratory quotient and how to calculate this respiratory quotient for carbohydrates fats and proteins and before going to see this respiratory quotient first we will see what is aerobic respiration because during aerobic respiration only we have to calculate this respiratory quotient so aerobic respiration is the process in which a complete oxidation of organic substance takes place in the presence of oxygen so this reaction is takes place in the presence of oxygen so this process is known as aerobic respiration if the respiration takes place without oxygen then it is known as anaerobic respiration okay and during this respiration there will be a release of carbon dioxide water and a large amount of energy present in the substrate that is present in your organic substance then respiratory quotient so during aerobic respiration we have seen that oxygen is consumed and carbon dioxide is released so during aerobic reaction your oxidation is taking place in the presence of oxygen and it releases carbon dioxide water and also energy for calculating respiratory quotient we have to take only the consumption of oxygen and the amount of carbon dioxide released during the reaction so the respiratory quotient or q is equal to volume of carbon dioxide evolved that is released divided by volume of oxygen consumed okay then this respiratory quotient is also known as respiratory ratio then this respiratory quotient depends upon the type of respiratory substrate used during respiration okay so the type of respiratory substrates are carbohydrate protein fat or organic acids etc Okay, first we will see how to calculate respiratory quotient for carbohydrate. So consider a substrate glucose. So C6H12O6 plus oxygen gives carbon dioxide, water and energy. So first you have to balance the reaction. Once you balance the reaction, then you have to calculate the volume of carbon dioxide evolved, volume of oxygen consumed. Okay, so the formula to calculate RQ is volume of carbon dioxide evolved divided by volume of oxygen consumed. Okay, so volume of carbon dioxide evolved is here. 6 carbon dioxide so 6 carbon dioxide divided by volume of oxygen consumed 6 oxygen so 6 carbon dioxide divided by 6 oxygen is equal to 6 divided by 6 that is equal to 1 okay so from this rq value we come to conclude that if rq value is 1 then there is a complete oxidation of your substrate that is here it is carbohydrate okay because here equal amount of carbon dioxide is evolved and equal amount of oxygen is consumed during the reaction okay that means there is a complete oxidation of your respiratory substrate okay next we will calculate rq for fat okay when fats are used in respiration the rq is less than one okay so see the calculation for fatty acid tripalmitin okay so formula to, for tripalmitin is c51 h98 o6 plus oxygen gives carbon dioxide water and energy here the reaction is balanced reaction okay so 2 into c51 h98 o6 plus 145 oxygen gives 102 carbon dioxide plus 98 water plus energy so rq is equal to volume of carbon dioxide evolved that is 102 102 carbon dioxide divided by volume of oxygen consumed that is 145 oxygen so rq is equal to 102 divided by 145 that is equal to 0 0.7 next we will calculate rq for protein okay when protein or respiratory substrate then the rq will be about 0 0.9 okay so for carbohydrate rq will be 1 and for fat 0 0.7 and for protein it is about 0 0.9 okay so consider a reaction that is respiratory substrate is alanine 
ओके सो द फॉर्मुला फॉर अलनाइन इज सी थ्री हेच सेवन ओ टू एन प्लस आक्सीजन गिवस यूरिया ओके सी ओ एन हेच टू ट्वाइस प्लस कॉर्बन डाइऑक्साइड प्लस वाटर एंड एनर्जी सो युअर बैलेंस्ड रिएक्शन इज टू इंटू सी थ्री हेच सेवन ओ टू एन प्लस सिक्स आक्सीजन गिवस यूरिया सी ओ एन हेच टू ट्वाइस प्लस फाइव कॉर्बन डाइऑक्साइड प्लस फाइव वाटर energy okay so the rq is equal to the volume of carbon dioxide evolved that is 5 carbon dioxide and the volume of oxygen consumed that is 6 oxygen so rq is equal to 5 divided by 6 that is equal to 0.83 okay thank you in the next video you will see the problems based on this practical question okay if you like my videos please do share and subscribe thank you